Hello YouTube, Shocked Aqua here. Welcome to my YouTube gaming channel. Today we are playing blah 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 blah. Wow. <laughs> we are playing Survive the Aftermath Part 2 or Episode 2 rather. And today one of our goals in the game is to get our gate up and running so we can actually get our people out into the world wide world and help us get some more resources. But a few things I need to do housekeeping wise first. Not make my roads such moronic examples here. Um, back the roads. Because I realized that wasn't the best way for that. But my city planning skills aren't always the best. But what I might do actually is do this. I know I'm, you see the trees falling. It's not how I want this to go, but this allows me to put some buildings in here too, or I could put like a park here. And speaking of which, now let's get some more of our um, more advanced buildings up. Let's get a trapper going. And... We got our road right there. We'll put our trapper right there. Uh, we got our that. We got the clean storage going. Uh, let's actually get a scrapper going. Let's see tab. Oh, I can fit that nicely in right there. So that's gonna allow us to get some metals in. Our recycle is going to be able to allow us to get some plastics in. And I'm actually going to build a road that for that. And then a lumber yard. Oh, the lumber yard is massive. Shoot. Well, let's do a lumber yard here. Oh. Uh, yeah, good thing I'm doing that here. There we go. Uh, the, the forester grows saplings and plants them in specified work areas. But I need wood, too. So let's actually... do this. Yeah. Let's do that. And then I'll worry about putting up uh, the forest later. But I wanted to put each of these three because this uh, gets us wood. This gets us plastics and uh, cloth, I think that's it, or fiber, yeah, fiber. And then that gets us metals and what's that other one? Parts or scrap or something like that. So that's up and running. Uh, all right, so f and actually, what I'm going to do is also build another and build another emergency shelter here right on the road. Uh, yeah, let's build that on the road so we can actually get another water well. Ooh, can't be placed on barren soil. That's 72%. Well, we'll do the 76% there. So 
we can get some more things up and running, but let's get this fishing hut up and running too. And the trapper up and running, because that's food. Yep, basic gathering. Got it. Basically, just go on a giant building spree. Doo -doo -doo. Let's actually speed it up a little bit. There we go. There we go. Now we get some fish going. Oh, okay. Uh, so a scrapper. Let's see. Um, that's plastic. Oh, I have a feeling I'm going to have to move all these guys in a minute. There we go, there's that. Get the plastics going here in a second. these out of the way first. Yeah, let's get these out of the way first so I can start expanding out this way. There we go. Ooh, I think I just might have screwed myself. see what they say. Uh-oh. An older colonist claiming the bear grave news has brought to you. They are shaking in its clear dismay. I saw a bright wave of destruction. It will hit tonight. You try to ask for more guidance, but the colonist has already passed out from stress. It is up to you to decide how to run. A bright wave of destruction. Uh, might be that... So let's do that. Oh, nope, it's a fire. That's a fire. Ah. 
Ouch. Well, dang. Dang, dang, dang. Crap. Uh, shoot, 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 shoot. Because we need we need those planks first. We need the planks first. Crap. I gotta build another house. Plastic going. Yeah, I know they're homeless. Link it up. get the let me get that up and running I'm trying to okay there's some planks over there too that we can do Feels good to be healthy again. Why, thank you, sir. Uh, da, 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 da. Really? Come on, I don't have anything else building. not use him right at the moment because we have nobody sick.
At least they're getting their roads built. We can get the gate up and run it. So let's get the gate. There we go. We'll get that going. They'll get that going. Yeah, I know. Oh, I gotta actually click on the circle. Okay. A group of colonists has gotten caring about what a nearby river and want to see what it's like for traveling. They managed to build a simple raft and are eager test it its foot. Sure, why not? The group finally returns with middling results. The boat started to leak halfway through and even worse than that, strong streams made the trip extremely exhausting. They had managed to catch some fish, but that's all the trip was worth. Hey, better than nothing. Yeah, getting some wood now. Okay, since this is going to be kind of like an outhouse area down here, let's do oh, whoops. Yeah, this is we'll put these on low. Uh, focus on getting rid of this one first. Oh, uh, work area. Move work area to here. There we go. Do, do, do. Oh, we'll clear out the bush first. So we're just missing the plastic, the wood, and the metal, but we'll have that coming to us. Nuclear fallout. Okay, here we go. Here's our first disaster. The horizon starts to turn in from blue to toxic green, and the air seems to burn with your lungs. To burn your lungs. These are the first signs of impending danger. Intense radiation is consistent threat to colonists, buildings, and crops weathering and dying during a nuclear fall. New seeds cannot be planted before it's over. Severe cases of radiation, sickness, and thirst take their toll on everyone. Harvest crops, harvest crops before they wither. Stockpile iodine pills to treat radiation sickness quickly. Build more tenic, medic tents or assign more workers to existing ones to help those who are in need. Build outhouses to reduce the amount of sick colonists. Okay. So these just got uh, upgraded to high. That can be stuck on low. Let's get actually another medic tent going then because I don't think...
Let's do two facing that way, and we'll do two facing this way. And we'll build a road. Or not. No carriers left. Yep, I know. Innocent lost. A small girl approaches you with a watery eyes and snot running from her nose. I can't find my cat. Please, she must. I can't sleep without her. She keeps me safe. The girl begs, her voice cracking. You could send someone to comb the nearby, but is it really worth it? Eh, certainly. Two happiness and eight fish. Okay. A few colonists venture out to look for the cat. The girl is beaming with joy, but you know that success is uncertain. However, the party soon returns with a massive white cat, who, judging by the fish the party is also carrying, have been hunting by the nearby river. Lady Fuzzy Whiskers, the girl squeeze, embracing the cat and immediately begins to purr. Alright. Um. Let's free him up. Let's free him up for right now. For carriers. Worried about the plastic right now. Get these outhouses built. I guess I really shouldn't have done that. Already, already, already. Come on, build that outhouse. There we go. Okay, so good on uh, water storage uh, food we got 34 venison 4 berries and harvestable crops consumption 10 production 6 Ooh, that's not good but we do now have outhouses Heal. There we go. 
three colonists irradiated. Oh, that ain't good. Four, five. That ain't cool. Oh, I need some research going. Oh, thank God that's going on now. There we go. That is going up. Good, 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 good. Oh, finally, the goal of this episode, we're getting there. Cool, 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 cool. Yep, and now, hopefully, once they get done treating. Okay, that's going up. Uh, let's build. And they'll actually build a road across that way. Yep, I'm freeing that up for you. Oh, hold on. Hungry mouse, busy hands. Your colonists suddenly approach you and drag you to one of the trees at the edge of the... Looking up, you can just barely see a faint... A silent feet dressed like the animal who is... Demand your feedback. Oh boy, that's not cool. Yay, congrats, you have built the gate and gained access to the world map. The gate is now open and the vast world stands ready for your specialists to explore. This progress has not gone unnoticed. Soon your colony will begin to attract in various folks, some good, others desperate, some tricksters, and those who just want you to see you destroyed. Arm the gate with colonists to keep some of specialists close by to defend yourself from inevitable raids. So, I'm actually going to send all of them out to the world map. So we can get some of that stuff taken care of. Alrighty. There we go. Now we can go to the world map and do stuff. So, she. Makeda is a fighter. So let's send her to explore the necessary things. Kate is a scientist. She's going to go get the research. Oh, hold on. She'll go do that. And Raj will go get the food. Oh, and she's already found somebody to... Alrighty. Oh, there we go. We got our first group of survivors to come to the gate. So we have two adults, one child. I wish I had been a farmer. I hear they're being treated like prophets now. <laughs> but he's bringing fish, tools, clothes, and wood. Okay. And we got a scout too, Crow. I will accept these people. Because they're going to help out a lot. And I'm going to send her to the world map too. Alrighty. Okay. Oh, no. Yep, they're working on it. Uh. 
I can get this up and running in no time. Oh, crap. That's out of, uh, wood. Okay. Uh, we'll do that to get that. Do it that way. There you go. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Now you guys can go back to going up here. Do that. All right. All right. So she's actually got that. Come on, Kate. Oh, researching location. Never mind, never mind. Have her fight. There we go. Ooh, and metal. Perfect. Supplies there. Research up there. Go ahead, roll. Oh, no, don't return a colony. Do not return a colony. Ah, pressing moving around. Yep, skip. Okay. So. How much... Alright, we need the plastics now. Okay, we'll keep one dock in there, but let's actually go to the research, because now we can actually do research, because we were able to go to the map. Production speed. Let's go ahead and research that food-wise. Production, we'll do crowbars next, which produces uh, metal and plastic produce, we'll do that. And then colony, heavy tarps, nurses, we'll do, we'll definitely do the nurses first, I think. I think that would be great. And then exploration, bartering. I don't think that's... I don't think... Uh, frontier Outpost. Unlocks Outpost Depots used for establishing and maintaining an outpost on the world map. Expanding your colony influence past its borders is essential for the colony's survival. Alrighty, so now that we've done what We've done our first research. We're basically just going to go down the line here. We'll do food, production, and then we'll do the nurses because we need that, those extra work slots for those people. Um, and actually, on our next time, we're actually on our, on this, ooh, okay, we're, okay, so he's clearing out this area good. 
gonna finish off this road. Okay. We'll actually have him start clearing the forestry guy who will clear out this area next, I think. Uh, let's see, production. Consumption 12, venison. I might need to do another fishery. Oh, actually, uh, hold on a second. Research. Oh, okay, so basically this is gonna... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So all these... Okay. Production plus one fiber. Okay. We're gonna have to start building some other things, too. Okay, let's see. Actually, colony. Communal living. Shanting a tenement. Okay, we kind of want to get those tenements quickly, too. I think after we do these productions to the colony, I think we'll stay in the colony and go to the communal living for our researching. Alrighty, cool. We have uh, kind of done what we set out to do this episode so guys gals ladies gentlemen and others if you like this episode please give it a big thumbs up by hitting that like button if you they still they still haven't built that have they we'll mark that as high oh because i don't have the product uh that's why got it got it got it got it oh and we'll actually We have that going. No, too. Okay. So we're going to have to start building some other uh, housing units, too. And we'll slowly start ex start expanding out this way, we'll, we'll kind of away from the pollution first. We'll let the trees finish uh, getting cleared out here. And then, actually, let's see, move work area. Okay. There we go. Put that more there so it takes care, care of uh, that whole section. And now... I might put another trapper. Oh, actually. Yeah, we kind of explored all out here. Any, okay. Anyways, I know I've continued on a little bit more than I should have. So guys, girls, ladies, gentlemen, others, like I said, hit that like button. If, leave, if you want to leave a comment in the comment section down below, please feel free to do so. It would very much be appreciated. And if you want to go ahead and subscribe to the channel, it helps the channel out. I'd very much appreciate that as well. So once again, guys, girls, ladies, gentlemen, and others, I am Shocked Aqua, signing off.